followed you home this weekend. We took pictures and we have proof, and we sent them in a text message to everyone in the school. Oh no, I can't believe this. She's been hiding this from everyone the entire time. I am feeling really good this week. I finally returned that dress that I got. I used to be a little bit of a bully, but after recent events, I finally started changing my ways. The worst thing happened. I stole someone's cell phone because I was jealous of the fact that there were no more available in the store. And that cell phone ended up having a spell on it that took control of my mind. It was the worst thing I've ever experienced. I couldn't control myself and the person that put the spell on it made me steal a dress from the store. Thankfully though, her sister found me and was able to break the spell before I got into any other trouble. After all of that, I realized that when I used to bully people, it must have made them feel so, so bad. So I've been making some changes in my life and I won't be doing that anymore ever again. Even if I get a little jealous of the fact that someone has something that I really want. It doesn't make it right to steal. Uh, anyway, let's spin the prize wheel. One thing though that I'm worried about is that while my mind was being controlled by the spell on that cell phone, I worry that it found all my secrets. I mean, what if it was asking me questions to try and find out information about me? I obviously would have had to tell the truth when answering those questions because I was being controlled. <sighs> That's something that I've been thinking about for the past few days. Like, I just can't get it out of my mind. Oh, I won diamonds. Oh, that's really going to help me buy food this week. Unfortunately, there's something that most people in this school don't know about me. I'd rather not talk about it, but every time I win diamonds at the fountain in the spinning prize wheel, it helps me survive another week here in Royal High. <sighs> anyway, let's go. Hey! Were you able to talk to Trent yet? You've had a crush on him for like the longest time and I think that it's time for you to finally tell him. I mean, what are you waiting for? Mmm, yeah, I know. Wait a minute, where were you this past week? I've been looking for you, we've got stuff to do. Oh, well, I went to Bloxburg. I had to hire a gold digger detective agency because my dad was about to make the worst mistake ever and marry this lady that only wanted him for his money. Oh, wow. That's nice of you doing that for your dad. Uh, yeah, but really, it's just so that I could spend more of his money because if he married that lady, she would spend all of it. <laughs> That's right. Anyway, so the reason why I haven't talked to Trent yet is because... I'm just really nervous, you know? Like, what if he doesn't like me? Oh, I'm sure he will like you. Everyone likes you. You're awesome. Yeah, but I mean, I'm kind of a bully and I always mess with people. What if he heard about all that and doesn't want to be around me? Well, if that's the case, then you'll cast a spell on him too, like everyone else. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Okay, wish me luck. I'm about to go and talk to him right now. <laughs> Hey Trent, uh, wait up. Yeah, what's up? You recall my name? Uh, we've never spoken before, but I know your name's Fiari. I've, um, kind of heard stuff around about you around school. You have? Have there been, like, <laughs> good things? Um, uh, not really. Everything I heard about her is that she's a bully. She bothers people, she pranks them, she uses her magic to intimidate them. She's evil, from what I've heard. Uh, well, I mean, I don't know. I, I just heard stuff, that's all. Oh, well, um, I was wondering if you were busy this weekend? A lot of people are going home to visit their families, but I'm going to be staying in the Royal Realms, and I thought maybe you'd want to get coffee or 
uh, like go and see a movie or something? Um, uh, sorry, but um, I'm kind of busy this weekend. Uh, yeah. Well, maybe some other time you'd like to hang out? Um, I don't think I'll ever have time, actually. Oh my goodness, is that someone calling my name? I must go. Goodbye. He's totally lying. No one was calling his name. Why doesn't he want to hang out with me? Are you kidding? I'm the most popular girl in school, and I'm one of the most powerful ones. How dare he? There's no way I'm going to hang out with a girl like that. She bullies people. I don't want any part of that. And there's something that I really like. Her name is Brianna. I was going to ask her if she wanted to hang out this weekend. <gasps> hey, I see her over there by the spinning wheel. Hey, Brianna, wait up. Brianna. Uh, hi, Brianna. My name is Trent, and um, just wanted to say, hey, what's up? Oh, uh, hey, what's up? I know your name. We have a few classes together. Is everything all right? Uh, yeah, everything's all right. But like, um, are you going home this weekend to visit your family and stuff? Uh, yeah. Uh, why? Oh, uh, I was just wondering if we could hang out. But if you're busy, it's totally fine. Um, yeah, I'm really sorry, but um, maybe we can hang out when I get back in town. I heard that there's like a really cool event coming up for Royal High that's related to Halloween. So we can go to that if you want, or like see a movie or something. Yeah, yeah, I would totally love that. Um, thanks. Uh, do you have a number? Can I get your number? Um, well, I actually don't have a cell phone right now. The store was sold out, and some drama happened, and I don't really want to talk about it, but, um, I can give you my email, so you can email me. Okay, yeah, cool, totally, totally. Alright, I'll see you around, Trent. Yeah, <laughs> see you around. You have got to be kidding me. He said he was busy, but he lied, all because he wanted to ask Brianna out. I thought I had seen the last of that annoying little Brianna. Didn't she have enough when we were controlling her with the cell phone from the spell that Fiona put on it? Oh, it looks to me like she wants more. Fiona, we've got someone's life to ruin. Come here, I need your help. Guess what? I just talked to Trent. And he totally lied to me, all so that he could try and hang out with Brianna. Wait, you mean the same Brianna, the one that stole my phone, who I put the spell on? Yes, that same Brianna. Do you still have that phone? Yeah. And you remember how you said you were going to use it to find out all of her secrets and stuff? Yeah. Did you do it? Yeah, I found out some of her secrets, but like, I don't have any proof of it. All I have is what she told the phone. Well, tell me some of those secrets, and I'll get proof of them this weekend, and then I'll text it to everyone in the school. Brianna will be so embarrassed that she'll drop out of school and transfer to another place. But we need to make sure that the secrets are super duper juicy. Uh, okay. Oh, I know one. Here, this was the biggest one. <gasps> That's perfect. Ooh, and it's gonna be so easy to prove. Alright, I'll follow her home this weekend, and I'll make sure I get proof of this. And then, come Monday, everyone will know, and she will be destroyed. And then I'll be able to go out with Trent because she won't be here anymore. I've got my bags and I'm just going to take the bus home and I'll be back on Monday. I just have to make sure no one's following me. If people find out my secret, I'll probably never be able to live it down. Especially after all that I've done in this school. I'm sure there are others that would love to get back at me. <sighs> anyway, come on. Hurry up, bus. I need to get home to see my family. Ah, that was such a fun weekend visiting my family. 
I always get a little sad when I go there, but uh, it's fine. Uh, they're the reason why I'm working so hard over here in Royal High, so that I can try and make a better life for us. Anyway, let- oh gosh, not you two again. What do you guys want now? Look, I just got back and I don't have time for any drama. <laughs> <laughs> now everyone knows. You may not have time for drama, but drama sure does have time for you. Your little secret is out to the entire school. Everyone knows that you're really poor and that you live in that terrible, disgusting slime city and that you've just been pretending this entire time. We followed you home this weekend. We took pictures and we have proof and we sent them in a text message to everyone in the school, including Trent. Yep, we sure did. Oh no, I can't believe this. She's been hiding this from everyone the entire time. Man, oh my goodness. That'll teach you to hang out with people that I like. What? I don't even bother the two of you. How could you do something like that? You're, you've embarrassed me. I... <laughs> now everyone in the school knows my secret. That I really come from a really, really poor family. And we live in one of the worst towns in the entire nation. Slime City. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. What will they think about me now? What will they think now that they found out that I've been lying to everyone? I mean, Royal High is full of some of the most royal, rich, and magical people in all of the realms. And now, they're going to know that I'm not one of them. They probably won't even invite me to parties anymore. And Trent, he probably won't even want to hang out with me. I can't deal with this. I'm not going to class today. I'm going to go back to my dorm room and just hide. Someone's at my dorm room. Uh, I don't even want to answer the door. It's probably going to be someone there to try and make fun of me. I need to just pack my bags and leave Royal High. Like, I can't take this. Hey, it's me, Trent. Can I come in? Hello? Oh no, it's Trent. He's probably here to make fun of me too. I'll just go out there and see what he wants. Look, I understand if you don't want to hang out with me anymore, alright? I'm, I'm sorry that I lied to you and everyone else. No, it's fine. When I found out, I was so shocked. Because that's not right for you to feel like you have to hide who you really are. So what you're not from a rich and royal family? Everyone comes from different backgrounds. You shouldn't be ashamed of that. And I'm crying because whoever found that out and used it to try and embarrass you in front of the entire school is an evil person. <sighs> anyway, everyone in the school wants you to know that we don't care. And when they all found out, they all donated a few diamonds to you. And it may not seem like a lot, but there are hundreds of kids in this school. And after all those donations came in, it totaled over 100,000 diamonds. Wait, you're saying that everyone in the school donated 100,000 diamonds to me? Yeah, we want you to know that we really care about you and that we're sorry that we you felt like you had to hide who you really were to us. Oh my goodness, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. Here, here's the check for all the diamonds. Go deposit it at the Royal Bank. And we don't have to talk right now if you don't want. I understand that a lot of things have happened and you're probably still processing all of this with those girls that tried to embarrass you. Just take your time, okay? Okay, I... Thank you so much. I... I thought that my life was going to be ruined after what they did, but it's not. Everything is actually better. And now I see that I should have never tried to hide who I really was. Exactly. I'll see you around, okay? Alright, see ya. Ah! Oh my goodness. 
This is insane. A hundred thousand diamonds? I can help my family with that. I can also buy new school clothes. I can also help some of the other students here that might not have enough to pay their tuition and stuff too. Oh my goodness. This has changed my life. Thank you for watching my channel. Pretzel and so Pretzel and so Pretzel and so